The royal wedding was just last month and since then I've been getting a ton of requests to transform into the new Duchess Meghan Markle. I hope this isn't too late, so here it goes. First, let's get started on the nose. So I'm going to elongate the tip using this nose and scar wax. Um, about that much will be enough and I'm just going to roll it. But before I apply that, I'm going to take a little bit of prosate on a Q-tip and start applying it just on that area where I'm going to press it on. This wax is really great if you want to change little things on your face. I just love using it on the nose. Now that the nose is done, I'm going to jump right into the makeup. So I'm taking Wonder 2 Cosmetics Foundation and this is medium coverage so it should make my skin look flawless and still give me that natural finish. Now I'm going to get busy with concealing. I'm taking Nabla Cosmetics Concealer and applying it to the high points on my face. The only little thing that I did different today is applying it on the jaws to make them wider. Once everything is nicely blended, I'm going to move on to contouring. So I'm taking OPV Beauty's Contour Stick and applying it on the sides of my nose first. I want the nose to look really small and slender. Um, also on the sides of my face, cheekbones, and then jawline gonna grab my beauty blender again start blending the whole contour keep it simple um, after that I'm just gonna set using this Too Faced setting powder I'm lightly gonna press and drag to set the under eye and also the cheeks the setting powder has no flashback so it's a huge plus after a few minutes I'm gonna dust off the powder you guys know the drill um, and then just apply benefits powder on the neck and the sides of my face now I'm working on the brows. So her brows are pretty dark. Um, so you want to use a dark brow pencil or a pomade. Also the arch is really high and then the tail end just comes down. To do her smoky eye, I'm going to take my Charlotte Tilbury Instant Palette and apply this taupe brown all over my eyelids. Next, I'm going to take an eyeshadow that is even darker than the one before and start applying it just on the crease. Lastly, I'm going to pick up the black eyeshadow and apply it more on the inner corners because her eyes are closer together than mine. Looks like she always has a sweep of brown eyeshadow on her lower lash line. So I'm going to do the same and for the inner corners, I'm going to make them brighter with a white eyeshadow. Now I'm going to pull the whole smoky eye together with this black eyeliner from M Cosmetics. Um, for the lower lash line, I'll use a pencil liner. I'm not sure if I want to use false lashes, but mascara is a must. So this is the DDK mascara. I'm just going to apply this fiber mascara on the top and bottom lashes. For that perfect rosy flush, I'm going to apply the Sweetheart's blush. And then we're going to work on the freckles. So I'm taking a light brown eyebrow pencil, just lightly pressing and twisting it on my nose, forehead, and also the chin. She definitely has that nice sun-kissed bronzy skin, so I'm taking this bronzer from Benefit and just applying it on the sides of my face. Moving on to the lips. So her lips are kind of similar shape to mine. It's just a little bit thinner and longer. So I'm just going to keep that in mind and shape it with this nude lip liner. Also, I wanted to share with you guys, this is M Cosmetics new True Gloss Lip Glosses. They are now available and today I'll be using this pink one right here called the secret blush and it's the closest to what she was wearing in her wedding so these are the lip glosses they're super comfortable non-sticky even has vitamin e and c and has light plumping before i do the hair i'm going to carve out my cheekbones make them look really deep and now i'm grabbing my curling iron and just curling the sides of my hair i probably should do my whole head but this is just a video the last thing I need to do is wear my veil and tiara. I already have this off-shoulder top on that kind of looks like her dress. And this is my final look. Also, this video is not complete without a red-headed prince. This is my prince for today. His name is Chewy and he is the cutest dog, guys. You have to follow him on Instagram. I'll have his handle right there. Um, thank you guys so much for watching and until next time, bye!